Hi, this is Stephen S. Wynn with Accelerate Joy, helping my fellow Christians accelerate joy and leave depression in the dust. You know, one of the ways that God has brought me out of depression is by helping me to see who He is more clearly. I've found that the more clearly I see His identity, the less depression I have and the more joy I have. And so one of the ways that I have experienced more joy and less depression is by studying who or what the Holy Spirit really is. In Matthew chapter 3 and verse 16, the Bible says, And Jesus, when he was baptized, went up straightway out of the water. And lo, the heavens were opened unto him, and he saw the Spirit of God descending like a dove and lighting upon him. And lo, a voice from heaven, saying, This is my beloved Son, in whom I am well pleased. In the Desire of Ages, the inspired commentary on the life of Christ, we read on page 111, Upon coming up out of the water, Jesus bowed in prayer on the river bank. And then skipping over to page 112, it says, Never before have the angels listened to such a prayer. They are eager to bear to their loved commander a message of assurance and comfort. But no, the Father himself will answer the petition of his Son. Direct from the throne, that's the Father's throne, issue the beams of his glory, the Father's glory. The heavens are opened, and upon the Savior's head descends a dove-like form of purest light, fit emblem of him, the meek and lowly one. Is the Holy Spirit someone separate from the Father and his Son, or is it the Father giving the light of his own comforting presence to his Son, Jesus Christ? This is Stephen S. Wynn, and I am praying for you that you will accelerate joy and leave depression in the dust.